then makes our presence and responsibility as continental and regional organizations extraordinarily important in view of the mandate of our organizations and the overall vision for a peaceful, prosperous, and integrated Africa. In the light of this, as short-term observers, you have a demanding task ahead of you, and I hope that this three-day briefing will enrich your understanding of the context of elections, as well as the level of preparedness of the Kenyan electoral stakeholders and the conduct of the 9th August 2022 general elections. I strongly believe that our joint mission together with other regional and international observer missions invited to these elections will make valuable contributions in strengthening the democratization of this country and promoting peace, stability, and prosperity in Kenya. I kindly request that throughout the mission, you apply strict neutrality and objectivity, as well as adhere to the African Union and COMESA codes of conduct for election observation, particularly respect the national laws, customs, and traditions of Kenya. Refrain from talking to the media, cooperate, and follow instructions from the briefing sessions, in particular, our coordination team. Over the past few years, the observation methodologies used by both the African Union and Comisa have improved, lending greater credibility to the work in election observation missions. Part of this improvement ensures that the mission's technical team objectively capture and analyze the information that you observers will send on election day. And this will form part of our overall assessment of the 9th August elections. And let me thank you most sincerely for making time to be part of this very important African exercise. Many of you might have previously observed elections in your own country or in other countries. But as you have noted, no two elections are the same. The political and electoral complexities vary as with the observer. However, the mandate of this joint African Union and Kumisa elect Election Observers Mission <coughs> is to make an independent, objective, and impartial assessment of the electoral process in accordance with the provisions of the international standards and the principles that our two organizations have committed to. These are the 2007 African Charter on Democracy, Elections and Good Governance, and the 2012 OAU-AU Declaration of Principles on Governance, Good Governance, Democracy, and Elections in Africa, and guides on the conduct of Comesa election observation missions. We should also measure these elections against the, the electoral laws of the Republic of Kenya. You may be aware that recent elections in Kenya have been marred by challenges and controversies and contested outputs. The 
9th August general elections, which you are here to observe, may not be different. The contestation for the presidential election is high. Citizens, voters, and candidates are paying full close attention to the process. The outcome and indeed the assessment of international observers is very important. Tension and anxiety, if not manifest,